Happy New Year! I'm getting sick of hearing that yet. We're already six days into the New Year, so of course, maybe we should start thinking of something else to say to one another. Maybe the reason why you are sick of hearing about the New Year is because maybe it's not such a happy year for you already. It could be because you've made resolutions and you maybe broke those resolutions already, or perhaps you sinned and that guilt is still there. You were hoping that you could have left that sin in 2020, and here it is in 2021, still with you. Maybe it's not so happy. Maybe that's the reason why you're getting sick of hearing people saying that and ready to move on. And then you can read through God's Word. It was a part of God's Word that I thought about today from Isaiah chapter 41. And God says this, Do not fear, for I am with you. Is that a good thing? If the reason why the new year isn't such a happy one for you is because you broke a promise, a resolution, or you have committed a sin that you thought was in your past, and then maybe it's not such a great thing to know that God is with you, right next to you, watching you commit that sin, watching you make that wrong, watching you break that promise. Ugh, not such a happy new year, right? But then think about it again. The rest of the passage such as this, do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. It made me think about Adam and Eve. When they first sinned, what did they do? They chose to run away from God. They chose to hide from God. And yet, what did God choose to do? God chose to come to them, to find them, to fix the problem. You see, sin, what it does is it pushes God away. It's not God running from us. He never does that. It's us pushing him away. And what does God constantly want to be? By your side, next to you. So if this year has already been not such a happy one, remember who's with you. The one who chooses to be with you. The God who has given you Jesus. Not just born in Bethlehem, but the God who has given you Jesus who died to take your sins so that you can be next to God someday in heaven. So happy new year. Actually, happy new day. With every single day, it's new because God is there, giving us the strength we need to make it through, giving us exactly what we need, what blessing we need every single moment, the forgiveness and love that is won for you by Jesus. Even if you broke a promise, even if you sinned, God doesn't run from you. He comes to you, wanting to stand next to you, be next to you, live next to you, so that you can be strong and one day live by him forever in heaven.